Hey guys, Dev here from Affinity Vibe YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you how to take a color grade from one image and use it in another image. Also create a LUT so you can use that same color grade every time on your other images. This method common word phrase is a still a color grade. Before start this video, be sure to subscribe and please hit that bell notification for getting update whenever I upload a new video. And you can also follow me on my Instagram where I upload my new artwork on a regular basis. Alright, let's start the process. For example, this is the image I like the color grade and want to take this color grade and use on this image or other image. So at first, here above right side, you will find a menu called swatches. But if you do not see here that menu, then go to top, view, studio, swatches, activate it. Now swatches menu available on your right side. Now go to this four square icon. Create palette from images, click on it. Here select that image you want to use and want to take color grade from it. Now this image number of color presents are 5 as a default plate. You can use all 5 if you wish, but 3 major colors are enough. Changing 5 to 3, hit preview. Now these 3 are the major color grade on this image. Click create. Now the color plate are ready to use. Go to below. Adjustment Gradient Map Now here gradient map we are going to use those color plate on our current image. Now here from left red one as shadow, green one as midtones and blue one as highlights. Now we need to use all three corresponding colors on each part as dark color goes to shadow, semi dark color goes to midtones and lightest color goes to highlights. Click on red part as shadow, click on the color, now click and drag this eyedropper over the dark color plate. Now click on the dark color and apply as shadow, click on green part as midtones. Again click on the color, same click and drag this eyedropper over the semi dark plate. Here light brown is a semi dark one. Again click on the color and apply as midtones. Click on the right blue part as highlights. Again click on the color. Same click and drag this eyedropper over the light color plate as highlights. Again click on the color and apply as highlights. When done, close it. Now here change blend mode to overlay or soft light both works well. Also you can experiment with other blend mode which one look good best for your image. Here I am keeping this blend mode to soft light. If you feel it looking very strong color mode then you can reduce opacity according to your need. I am keeping it as 100%. This is an optional curves. Now create a LUT so you can use this same color grade on other images. Go to top menu, file, export LUT, give a name as you like it. Click on export and save as a cube files.
Now go to other image, adjustment, scroll down, LUTs. Click this gear icon, import, select your current color cube and apply it. You always have an option to play with opacity or blend mode. Now color grade visual depends on image to image resolution. And that's it. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, don't forget to click the like button, sharing this video, subscribing this Affinity Vibe YouTube channel to get more amazing Affinity Photo effect tutorial. Also share your valuable comment on this video. You can connect me on my Instagram account, link in video description and also you can check out the other amazing video just waiting for you in this channel playlist. Thanks for watching, I am Dave from Affinity Vibe YouTube channel and I will see you on next video soon. Till then, keep practicing cause practice makes us perfect and have fun with Affinity Photo.